I'm, I'm Janet. I'm 29 years old. I'm not from Armenia, but I have been living here since 2006. Well, I, I say that I'm Colombian because my father worked for like as a police, so police officer. So I have been living in I have lived in many cities in Colombia, but mostly I grew up in in Cali. So when somebody asks me when where I'm from, I say Cali because Cali is in my heart. That's the city that saw me growing. Yeah, I love salsa, of course. Um, I was born in Santa Marta and I grew up in, in Cali, so the flow is in my veins. Well, we're doing fine. Uh, right now I'm staying at my boyfriend's house, which is a country house, as you see. So I don't feel a lot of confinement here because I can go out, I take the, fr I can breathe fresh air. Like I'm not in enough for, uh, inside a wall uh, but my dad is doing also fine I think we feel blessed because during this economical crisis uh, we have stable jobs that let us go through this moment and we have our salary uh, monthly so we don't, we don't worry about the money we worry more about our health yeah I'm able to work uh, I'm working online. I'm a teacher. I work for a company, for an institution that belongs to the government. It is called SENA. So I can work mm -hmm. online through online platforms, but I have a tiny problem with this. And the people that I teach, they come from low income families. So they don't have uh, internet access. Mm -hmm. So as a teacher, I had to come up with the strategies, ideas to provide the information to the students and still give them a quality education. He, he, can, he also works for the government. He works like in an investigation department of the government. So he can bring his all his paperwork to, to home and work online. Okay, so I'm a teacher, so I have a lot of things to do. <laughs> like I don't get bored. I have uh, pl uh, lessons to plan, uh, grade exams, many things. But students, they went on vacation. Uh, last week because the government said that students had to take advanced vacation. So for me not to get bored because I have more time for myself, at 8 o'clock I'm already showered and dressed. And then I turn my laptop on and I do some online courses uh, to keep myself entertained, to study and, and update in my profession. And then I try to exercise. Uh, I get in the swim swimming pool, I watch movies, I talk to my boyfriend. I try to do activities to keep myself entertained. Everybody's expecting from this is that we have like a change of our mind, you know, because we people, we are very, we care more about superficial things, about consumerism, about getting many material things. And I think this will change um, how we should care for each other, be more generous and care the, the, for the planet. Because as you have seen, with this confinement, nature is is um, getting better. We see clearer uh, seas, the fresh air, the ozone layer is getting better. So the virus is us. <laughs> the poor are the ones who are suffering this the most because most of them, they are street vendors and they're not getting any income to provide food and other things for their families. But one thing that you mentioned about Colombia and that we like to socialize, we are, we have something that we are very united. And in this situation, many Colombians that are very generous, they're getting united to collect um, money or groceries to give a hand to the ones who need it the most. And, and regarding to the government, the government has taken some measures. One is to give an extra money to some people that belong to special um, special programs like the elderly, 
uh, single moms, uh, vulnerable teenagers. And so they're getting like an extra money of the ones that they monthly got. Um, also about the utilities, the government is giving free utilities to low income families and or, or credit. Like during this crisis, you don't need to pay your, your utilities, but you will pay it later after this happens. But you will pay it in a low rate uh, for a long period of time. It could be for a year or more. And also, I think it is the same with the taxes. Taxes, mortgages, or other things, they are getting postponed. So you're going to pay it after uh, in credit. Like right now, I have to pay my mortgage, but I'm not able to go out and do it. So I will pay it after this crisis. I think the restrictions are good. They are good measure, measures, but the problem is the people. Like we are very social and we like to go out and do stuff. Uh, so people are getting crazy because they have to stay home. But I think we need to, to change that switch that we have and try to stay home as much as we can. We have those restrictions that we can only go out uh, according to how your ID number ends. So, but people, although they don't need to go out to do anything, they have, they feel like they need to go out and buy groceries and do stuff. And before the confinement started, uh, people were doing big lines on, in the supermarket to buy a lot of groceries, like if it were the end of the world. So I think we have already plenty of things at home. We don't need to go. We don't need to go out. People are going out because they say, okay, this day I'm able to go out. I, I'm going. I think we have to stay home as much as we can. Just go out if it is strictly necessary. Colombians were very optimi optimistic. <laughs> we have gone through many difficult things, war, many bad things in, in our country, but still we have a smile on our face. Like we, we have to come up with this lively and look for things, how to solve the, the problems. So it's, it's natural in Colombia. We are lively people. If, 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 you go, if you go to a poor neighborhood here in Colombia, you will see things that will make you like reflect, like you see children playing barefoot but they look very happy you see you listen to music you see a lot of dancing like they enjoy life despite of the problems they have in their lives well there are there are rumors that this can continue like longer and i think people will feel uh uneasy to stay home for a longer period of time because i'm mo I, I say mostly because of money like people need to go out in colombia sadly that's the situation we have a lot of unemployment there are no a lot of formal jobs so people need to go out to sell things to provide a service to bring food to their families but i think in this moment is the ones who have a little bit more than others we need to help the ones who are in need if this continues longer we need to be generous and give each other a hand because they they when this ha finishes they won't have money to survive. Okay, if I have to talk about the national government, I will say that the local government made right decisions prior to the national government because you saw on, on, on the news how the president discredited the confinement that the mayors wanted to do in their cities. And for me, I felt disrespectful how the the president will um, the discredited the good things that the mayors were doing. And also because the president was a little bit resistant of closing the, the airport, but he had a lot of pressure from, from Colombians, the citizens, that he had to do it. But I think... Uh, the the mayors are are teaching a lesson 
to the president. But anyway, like I think the the Colombia started a confinement in an early stage. So I think we're doing fine, and um, there are not a lot of um, uh, cases in Colombia compared to other countries. So I think we continue doing like this, staying home as much as we can and following the restrictions, we're going to do fine and we're going to overcome these problems. Well, I don't know. I think as human beings, we need, as I said before, it's a time for reflection. Like after this crisis, I think the, the world need to, to change. Humans need to change. Change maybe some bad habits that we have, uh, try to protect the environment a little bit more, uh, be more generous, don't be superficial because we're, if you have a lot of money and you cannot go out and spend it, like it doesn't work for, for anything. So we have to care more about, I don't know, sharing with your family, spending time with your family, like other things that make human beings uh, greater uh, living beings you know but so we we need to change our minds for the better okay enjoy your confinement <laughs>